Welcome my fellow travelers, your traveling buddy here coming today from a rainy day in Sault Ste. Marie. And we're coming down here, we're going to check out the Sioux Locks. Supposedly there's yeah. some ships coming in and we're going to check them out. So travel with me, will you? And this is Sault Ste. Marie and yeah. we're down here with our family. We're going to come down here and check out the Sioux Locks. There's the actual the bridge that goes over to Canada. Okay, see that big bridge over there? It goes over to Canada. Check it out guys, look, look, look behind you, look behind you, there's Bigfoot! I found Bigfoot everybody, he's in here in Sault Ste. Marie. And you found Mary Poppins? And I found a dork, I'm Mary he's Poppins. called Mary Poopins. I'm Mary Poppins. No, Mary Poopins. Mary Poppins. Look out, I'm trying to film Bigfoot. There's Bigfoot, there's Bigfoot everybody. Love I found him, look at those big feet. Rob, is that you? No. Nah. <laughs> now this is free to come down here, but I will let you know that you search it. They just check my backpack and stuff like that. Security reasons, you know, the border and stuff like that. Oh, there's a boat coming through right now. Oh, there's a boat. There's some kind of freighter coming through. Right there you see it through there. A nice most of the day, but of course we're getting some rain out. Yeah. And I'm bored. And I got a dorky nephew that keeps trying to photobomb me. Anybody want a free nephew? Hey, that's messed up. He might mop, mop your floors for you. No. <laughs> Check this out. They got a memorial here in memory of those dedicated cop. Uh, corps of engineers employees who lost their lives in the line of duty right here International Shipmasters Association and that's pretty cool I don't know did they fall in the water or what I don't know how did they die in duty would you get out of my picture <laughs> nephews I'm telling you <laughs> I'm trying to there like I said, I don't know. Did somebody lose their lives? I don't know. Interesting question. Now here's a demonstration of what the locks is. See how the ship comes in here and then they raise or lower the water to the level that they want. It's like say he came in here, they raised it up to there, goes through there, that's how it works. See? Actually, that's how it's. So he came in here. He goes through the lock. They lower him down to that level, and then boom. That's how the locks work. See? You can kind of look out and see the water. Well, we got to wait till a ship comes through. I know, but let's go to the top. But well, yeah, you can see the locks right there. There's the gate. There's the gate right there. There's the bridge. That's the international bridge. Yep, it goes over to Canada. And there's a bunch of smoke over there. That's just the factory. Okay. <laughs> see, there's the the gate there when he comes in. See how low the water is. I see the bridge. It looks like there's a. I don't know if that one's coming in or not. There's a freighter right there. You see it. There's a freighter sitting right there. Bridge. Canada is right over there. Yes, that's Canada right over there. Yeah. Right across the here we are at the very top of this thing. This is cool that they got the structure. You can come up here and watch it. 
you know this is the third floor they do have a handicap accessible down below and all that so yeah now we just have to wait for a ship to come through There's another freighter right over here. I don't know if he's coming. He, I think he's coming in. Yeah, he's coming in. Here's a demonstration of the predecessor of it. This is how the canoes used to do it. See? They had old style canoe would come in here. They would lower the water down and right in there. Never knew that. That's kind of cool. Now there's some ducks down there in the lock. There's a couple ducks. Oh, yeah, the, actually, I think that boat's going into that part there because there's two locks right there. There's one there. That one is getting closer. It's getting closer. He's, uh, I haven't watched. I actually visit, uh, toured uh, one that turned into a museum called the Valley Cat. Oh, here comes the t boat tour. This is the one that they do. With the, you can actually take a boat tour on there. Right here. I want to do that someday. It's like $30 a person, I think, for the boat tour. That's cool. He's going to come in. Maybe we're going to see them brace him up. Okay, I got a crane. Look at, look at the crane going down. The crane's making a motion. It's probably going to stop so nobody else can come in. Uh, actually, it's like a, uh, almost like the train, you know, the, the drawbridge thing. Or you mean you know what I'm talking about? You're like, so nobody else can come in. That's cool. Yeah, I want to do that one of these days. That's pretty cool. Everybody's got attention on that boat. See, they're anchoring them. See, they're pulling the rope up. Anchoring them. So it's ready. See, right down below us. This water's gonna go up. See, he's going over there. So they're gonna raise the water. Freighter, it's getting closer. <laughs> See, he's down there. He tells the history of the locks, and you can kind of hear him down there. I like that flag that they have in the boat. You see what it's going for? Notice they closed the gate. See the big gate over there? This one. Now it's all closed up. And that freighter, it's getting closer. We probably gotta wait until he gets in. Oh, 
Uncle Buddy. The ducks made it. They're not going to get crushed. Oh, that's all. I thought the boat coming. <laughs> you now you can see the name of that ship, or the freighter. It's called the Paul R. Trocothro. The internal, uh, interlake steamship company. I like how they have all the flags right here. <laughs> Those things are huge. Like a small boat and a big boat? Like... Yeah, they're gonna lift them both. I know. They're filling, the water's filling now. Look, you see that they're swirling. See? See that? You're gonna start seeing the ship coming up. There it goes. They're going up. Hey, you see the swirling in the water. That's the water coming up. It comes up from the bottom. Look at that freighter. That is crazy. Sorry. There we go. Well, that's better. I didn't realize I was zoomed in. Yeah, you see it? See? Now you can kind of see where the roof, the line, it's raising up. That is insane. That is crazy, guys. Just like filling up a big bathtub. <laughs> And then there's our freighter. He's coming in. Thought they were gonna do them at the same time, but nope. He's a long, he's a long boy. Look at him. Hey, look at that. That's crazy. We were just staring at its roof. Now you can actually see the actual boat. There's the captain. See the captain in the door. There's the captain. They're raising you right now. I just noticed that. Yeah, you didn't notice that? You just... My nephew didn't even notice they were raising it. Look at it. Well, I thought you said they were going to do it at the same time. So no, I thought they were going to do it at the same time, too, but I was wrong. But I was waiting for that. And like... you didn't... It's still raising. See? Look. See? No. Look, at, look at the bottom window. I know. I can't there was like boxes over there and I was looking at the boxes and the boxes kept getting filled up. Look at that. Look, you can see right there the numbers now at the bottom. Five and four. See? It's called the Hiawatha. That's what that boat is called, Hiawatha. 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 Wow, look at you see, you can actually see the lettering coming up now too, see? Sue. And before you know it, you'll be able to read the locks. Raising another one right now too. Not. It's a big boat. Look at that. 
So look at that. You can kind of read it now. See the locks. Boat tours. It's not like the whole thing with the water. Oh, the seagulls are actually watching them. That's crazy. Now you can see it. Yeah, you can see the whole boat. Look at that. Before you were just looking at basically the roof of it. And those people are here. Now you see the whole boat. I wish I was on the boat when I was doing this. That would be cool. What did happen? The gate's opening. See? The gate's opening now. See? Look. I'm going to zoom in on it. There goes the gate. Just notice past there, if you can look right there, there's a freighter out there. It's got a tugboat hooked to it and it's pulling it out. There it is, see? Now they're level. And then you can move up. That, that freighter is still coming in. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. How long that freighter is. It's just inside there. Waiting. There you go, they're raising the, they're raising the, what do you call that thing, you know, what is, if you know what the name of that thing is, leave a comment below, you know, kind of like what they do on the train, uh, when trains hit the road, that's kind of cool. There they go. She's unhooking the rope down here. And now the Hiawatha is going to pull out. There's another boat waiting. Oh, there it goes the ears. <laughs> <laughs> that was loud. There he goes. He's clear to go. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> That's come. I, I got to do that one of these days. Yeah, 30 bucks a piece, a person, I believe. It's not bad at all. There he goes. That's a good example of what the locks is like. There he is. 
Okay, now that this one's coming in, I'm gonna film this and I'll probably do the fast, you know, speed it up, show you what it's like. How they get the freighter up. I can't get the full freighter in there, but that'll be cool to see what it looks like when they raise that big boy up. Ow. I was just told that they, they, they just realized they can't close the gate thing right there. But they, somebody told me this is the largest freighter on the lake, Lake Michigan. I just noticed it's raining again. Good thing we're under this. Yeah, that's the largest freighter in the Lake Mich, uh, the Great Lakes. ship on the Great Lakes. You know, it just went through the locks. I hope you like that. That was pretty cool. <laughs> Alright my fellow travelers, that's about it for this little trip to the Sioux Locks over here in Sault Ste. Marie. This was a great fun. I hope you enjoyed the watching that and spread that out, you know. Pretty cool to watch those big ships go through and, and all that and how they do that. You know, raise them up like that. Big old boy like that pretty cool but then again I got my nephew with me <laughs> kids <laughs> you gotta love them but why right but if you like this video give me a thumbs up share me out share me on all the social media tell your friends tell your family about me so I can continue traveling and showing you cool stuff like this also if you want to make a donation there's a link above it for you. if you have any guys for me to do let me know I just might show up and do it so until next time my fellow travelers you have a blessed day, and I'll see you around the mitten.